Ladies and gentlemen, you're welcome to Knucklefix Design Studio. This is another tutorial on how to design posters, flyers, and Corel Draw. So let's get to work. Now we have a Corel Draw here, and everything we want to use is straight right here. So all we just need to do is the first, first arrange whatsoever you want to do. Arrange it. I'm not going to take much of our time because. Coral draw is um, is a you know kind of a big tacky so all right so right now this is gonna be here control X and okay control V so I like to put together come here and let's give it um, yeah, okay mm, this is cool press T so that both of them will be in this thing and increase it a little bit alright we'll come back to this okay so it's in position and right now uh, we ungroup this and bring this straight here mm, back uh -huh. control A and click here centralize okay so click out this two a straight uh, is here all right so we have this number also here mm -hmm. we have this number here and this email here so right now let's just get done with the arrangement because okay all right I bring this here increase this Hold your shift and drag. Okay, escape. Click escape and come back here. And straight there, you have a pen. You have a pen too. So now, what I want to do now is bring in the image that we want to use. Okay, which is this. Good. So you have this image right here. You see now that we have everything going. So all we need to do now is create our. To create the background and beautify hmm. if you don't mind I think we are done <laughs> no we are not done so right now every other thing in this place is set <clears throat> all we need to do is beautify this design so straight let's quickly do this this is the first thing we we'll need to do all we need to do first is create this background first uh -huh, at the bottom here and give it a gradient color okay let's give it green color green and come here and give it interactive feel so just drag it anyhow and okay bring this here and take this here so what we what you do is come here give it this darker shade and here to give it this uh, green dark shade too moreover we can actually create pick colors from here but no problem let's just do what let's just do this so 
I guess we go so control end to take it or you click on the object undo you click on the object and say order to pack of page good so that's it you can actually give this white give this outline right click on this right click on this to for outline so for all fonts okay so for this font too you can just come here and click so to give it yellow all right so i think mm -hmm, it's getting we are getting there so right double click on this two you see that i created this inside here so what we want to do right now is we want to start creating this so everything will now be inside this box so click on this right click on this and see power and click power click inside here so now you see what we have here now creates a circle as be a very big circle by holding your shift and control to, to create a perfect circle so bring it right here now let's give it a uh, color white and uh, interactive field to gradient make sure the gradient is this gradient and uh, outer outer part select a darker shade of white aha uh -huh. this is what i'm talking about so and increase increase so to give us undo to give us a so carry it from here all right that is good so right now we want to work on the outline this is outline so make the outline um, about 16 thicker so it's the outline is thicker so right now right click on the outline or click object and say convert outline to object so right now we have a very good object you can actually right click and drop it on this object this one and say fill can you see we have a very nice feel so instead of that just hold on just press g and click and you know change the color to somewhere around very deep yellow mm -hmm. and come up here and become yellow aha okay so let's let's come down here Mm, I'm trying to rush the design because color draw takes a lot, way, 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 lot of time. But you know, don't worry, we are all gonna get there. All right, so we have this, and um, click on this. Oh, sorry. So once you're through with this, all you just need to do is, see, you just click on either this place, just click on that place, or you hold on your control and click. So click on this and right click to remove the outline. Now we are good to page. So can you see that it's more it's more like it right now? So right now every other thing right here is just a uh, time 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 and time and time and time. So put this white. Aha. Uh -huh. So create a box, a rectangle right here and let's leave it at this size give the color yellow uh, gradient big circle mm -hmm. increase it a little bit aha uh -huh. and so here you can actually pick yellow or you click this and come and pick the color here good and come here and you know make the make it a bit deeper so good so right now we're having a kind of goldish color so right click and just say, just click here and order back one back one or whatever you want to bring to the front just highlight it I like what you want to bring to the front and click this other front of page. All right, so that that's it. So click this right now. Let's zoom into this place. Can you see? So click this and click this. And 
come to eye line uh, eye line just see center all right so I guess this design is as good as you're looking at it so control I so every other thing is you can actually zoom into this place zoom into this place pixel cool and just you know make it a little bit smaller yellow color right click to remove the outline uh -huh. come here remove snap to object so that that's not disturbing us yep okay so hold on your shift key right click it hold on your shift key and right click then select the three select the three of them ctrl g oh yeah bring it right here and right click so ctrl height we have a very nice beautiful flyers so we don't need to be all right now so let's delete it so since you know we don't need any other thing right here so ctrl e to export and say let's click tutorial flyer flyer and you click on click either you want to save as png pdf or jpeg so let's save as jpeg export so after exporting mm -hmm, it's gonna take a little bit of time don't mind because we've not saved for a long time uh, yeah so instead of saving as cmyk because you want to use it for design just save as rgb mm -hmm. okay then click ok so let's go to where we save it and we have let's click t all right so we have our design okay so thank you guys i really appreciate you guys hope you've learned something and if you find anything so difficult a little bit about this place let me know message me and thank you subscribe to my channel see you once again next time bye